The Bitcoin bull flag is breaking out right now here and in this exact video I will be talking about my price targets but more importantly I will be talking about this market structure because right now we are officially confirming the breakout of the bull flag but as well we are seeing a weaker pump towards the upside than the previous rallies towards the upside and actually this is the biggest rejection we've been getting so far in this entire trend towards the upside so next Make sure to watch this video till the end it is an extremely important update video i will be going over my trades what i will be doing right now here and much more things will be getting discussed so don't forget to slap up that like button on today's update video can we once again smash it back about 400 likes since we yesterday have been exactly predicting that the market was going to rally towards higher levels so don't forget to slap up that like button and let me jump straight away in towards the content and of course first of all i want to start talking about the exact price targets of this bull flag for bitcoin so like you can see right now we confirmed the breakout on the uh, yeah bitcoin bull flag and as well we can see that the previous downward sloping resistance line is currently flipping into support for bitcoin so let's see how this is actually going to be playing out from of this point onwards but if i'm going to be measuring the price target of this exact bull flag you can see that the price target is still not being reached and it is somewhere around the 24.8k so let's see if we can still reach this price target however we also still got the previous bull flag from of this point right here and the price target of that one is also 24.8k so the price target of the bull flag isn't met yet so far we can see we broke the downward sloping resist line and currently the previous resistance is flipping into support so if we can bounce from off this level and of course continue to break out towards the upside that is going to be beautiful because then we could still of course officially play out the bitcoin bull flag if it doesn't the question really is what is going to be happening next for bitcoin and i have been talking about what is next for bitcoin for quite a while here and this is a chart without any drawings or whatsoever and i've been talking about that the first parabolic run-up has been very exponential the second one has been less exponential and if the third one so the next rally from of this bull flag right here is going to be even less exponential we could maybe have to start to worry and if i'm looking at this rally right here we could maybe argue it has been a weaker one we officially confirmed a weaker rally towards the upside so i am not going to say this yet so far but currently it looks to be that this rally right here is weaker than the previous one and the previous one was weaker than the first one and if this is going to be true we could be expecting to see another significant rally towards the downside we could see a potential dump for bitcoin why is because once a parabolic structure ends you can see a market goes like this like this and then gets weaker it usually indicates that there is a reversal coming and it, i'm not saying that bitcoin is going to dump down to 16 or fifteen thousand dollars. no i could be saying here that bitcoin could see a small retracement back towards levels somewhere around twenty one thousand US dollars and it really also depends on what is going to be happening on the 1st of February because on the 1st of February there's going to be an FOMC meeting however if Bitcoin is going to be seeing that release towards the downside the target where I am expecting all the support is going to get found is on this level right here this 21,000 US dollars so 21 to 21.1 K that is the level what I'm exactly expecting that Bitcoin is going to be having a bounce from so let's see how it is going to be playing out right now here but currently I am expecting that this level is going to be providing a significant amount of support if Bitcoin is going to be having a retest of this exact level right here so let's see how it is going to be playing out right now here hopefully we could be bouncing from this level but if not if we do not retest it at all but let's say Bitcoin is going to be moving further towards the upside and is still reaching its price target of the bull flag we are of, of course not going to talk about this level because yeah if we really have that movement towards $25,000 and then have a retracement, we could maybe find already support around $23,000, right? So this is only for the imminent short term. If Bitcoin is really right now going to confirm a break below the previous low on the market. So if we do confirm a four hourly candle close below this range right here, so that is approximately 22.5K, then I'm expecting we're going to see that drop significantly down towards levels of 21.3K. That is what I'm currently expecting. So let's see how this is going to be playing out right now here but anyways this is the exact way how i'm trading it currently i am still in my bitcoin long position like i said if we confirm the bullish breakout on the bull flag i'm going to scale up my trades however since this breakout was so weird 
so fast and of course right now is not even trading on these higher levels anymore i am not going to skill up my position right now here i'm still going to be staying very very cautious so what i'm currently doing is adding more orders to buy more in towards my bitcoin long position on 21,000 us dollars so if we're going to have the crash i'm going to be the one who's going to be buying more in towards my trade around that level and if we do break further towards the upside i will just casually write my trade further on towards the upside and make more money from it that is the strategy that i will be using myself right now here if you're interested in trading you could do so because if you sign up an account using the link in the description right now you can claim a 30 thousand US dollars deposit bonus if you sign up a new account on Bybit in the link in the description right now and if you're living in the US or and if you're living in the US you can trade on BitGet without VPN and without KYC with also 20,000 US dollars deposit bonus if you sign up an account in the link in the description so make sure to check it out right now here then of course looking at the three day time frame we can currently see that we did broke the legendary trend line here for bitcoin this is of course an important trend line to be monitoring and like you can see we broke above it and ever since we basically brought uh, broke above this level we flipped this level into support so this is an important level to look at and yeah currently we are seeing that small little relief towards the upside so hopefully we could see that further continuation happening right here and uh, yeah definitely i am looking uh, quite bullish on the bigger perspective for bitcoin only on the imminent short term bitcoin is just creating bearish divergences it is looking a little bit overbought here and currently i'm just taking it extremely slow here on the price section of bitcoin right now here so let's see how it is going to be playing out right now here but anyways this was it for me on today's update video i truly hope that you did learn anything from the market structure that currently is playing out because this is really the time to pay attention towards the market right now here so don't forget to subscribe to the channel slap on that like button and i'll see you guys on the next one peace out goodbye